Welcome to the Social Lens and thank you for watching. In a significant development aimed at addressing South Africa's persistent power challenges, the Minister of Electricity announced that the new nuclear procurement determination is in the process of being gazetted. This comes after the National Energy Regulator South Africa, NERSA, granted the minister the green light to proceed with the procurement process of 2,500 megawatts of nuclear power. The minister emphasized the importance of this move in ensuring national security and energy sovereignty, marking a crucial milestone in a historically controversial process. South Africa has been grappling with severe power shortages, leading to frequent and debilitating power outages. These challenges have had widespread implications affecting industries, businesses, and households across the country. The decision to pursue nuclear power as a means to augment the existing generation capacity reflects the government's commitment to finding sustainable solutions to the energy crisis. During a media briefing in Pretoria, the Minister of Electricity expressed the government's commitment to securing an additional 2,500 megawatts of nuclear capacity. He emphasized the significance of this undertaking, noting that the historical nuclear procurement process had been marred by controversy. The minister's assertion of the government's dedication to ensuring energy security and sovereignty underscores the critical nature of this initiative. Zizamele Mbambo, the individual responsible for nuclear power at the Ministry of Energy, provided further insights during a press conference. According to Mbambo, the nuclear plant is anticipated to be commissioned between 2032 and 2033. This timeline sets the stage for a gradual but crucial integration of nuclear energy into South Africa's power grid. The ambitious plan aims to pave the way for a departure from the frequent power cuts that have plagued the nation. The National Energy Regulator of South Africa's approval of the nuclear procurement process is a pivotal step in realizing the government's vision for enhanced energy capacity. The regulator's decision acknowledges the pressing need for a diversified and sustainable energy mix to alleviate the strain on the existing power infrastructure. With the regulatory hurdles cleared, South Africa is set to launch a bid for 2,500 megawatts of nuclear energy. The bidding process is expected to attract national and international stakeholders, fostering competition and ensuring the selection of the most viable and efficient nuclear technologies. The procurement process will play a crucial role in determining the future energy landscape of the country, as well as the technology and partners involved in the nuclear power project. As industries and businesses grapple with the economic repercussions of power outages, the prospect of a reliable and consistent power source is met with anticipation and relief. Despite the government's announcement of the initiation of the nuclear procurement process to address South Africa's energy challenges, there is skepticism among some South African citizens regarding whether the plan will materialize this time. Historical controversies surrounding previous attempts to introduce nuclear power have left a lingering sense of doubt and mistrust among the public. Concerns range from potential delays and cost overruns to transparency in the procurement process. While the government emphasizes the significance of this move, winning the trust of the skeptical population will be crucial for the success and acceptance of the proposed nuclear energy initiative. As the nation eagerly awaits the bidding process and subsequent developments, only time will reveal the true trajectory of this ambitious undertaking. Time will tell whether this initiative becomes the beacon of a transformed energy landscape, free from power cuts, or if it will succumb to the challenges and skepticism that have shadowed previous attempts. The journey toward a more robust and reliable energy future for South Africa unfolds, and the outcomes will be written by the hands of time. If you found this video informative, please click the like button and consider subscribing to the channel. Until next time.